We will check back in. Thank you. Well, new this morning, some incredible innovations are being created uh, right here in Oklahoma City. Medical innovations. Yeah, a new augmented reality company called Chironetic is hoping its technology transforms the way surgeries are performed. News 9's Jordan Daphnis live in studio to explain how it works. Jordan? Lacey and Storm, this was one of the coolest stories I've done because I haven't really played with VR or augmented reality a ton. These goggles are, would be worn by surgeons during surgeries to help them perform better. You got to hear this. We've noticed that our uh, surgeons feel better doing these surgeries. Our patients get better outcomes. Uh, it it um, is safer. Dr. Christian Alum has extensive experience as a surgeon. I specialize in pediatric malformations. Uh, it's a very difficult technical field where a lot of imaging, a lot of planning is needed. In 2018, thanks to an Innovation District networking event, he recognized AR technology could be useful in surgeries. And Chironetic was born. Would just wear it, put it on their head, and then operate. It is uh, activated uh, using voice commands. It is activated by using hand tracking technology. So you can um, almost see through the patient as you're operating with that technology. It's been used in more than 100 surgeries so far, and last year the device was cleared by the FDA. Now the Oklahoma-based startup is going national. So now we're aggressively trying to commercialize the technology and working with different hospitals across the country who are starting to, to pilot the technology and really starting to validate the clinical benefits that this technology can bring. For Dr. Alum, who primarily works on children, he believes this technology is life changing. This technology is making a difference today and it will make a difference hopefully throughout the country. Well, this is just one of the businesses that is a part of the Oklahoma City Innovation District. So be on the lookout as we show you more in the coming months. In studio, Jordan Daphnis, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.